Hey friends, welcome back. I have another kettlebell workout for you. This one's super short and I'm not gonna lie, it's gonna suck. Uh, we're gonna do a 20 minute, it's actually 16 minutes of work, but with the rest 20 minute total Tabata workout with a lower body focus. So what that means, is there's gonna be four moves. Um, so it's gonna be 20 seconds on, 10 seconds rest for eight rounds of each exercise. So each exercise only takes four minutes but it's really, really tough. Um, I'm not gonna be talking much during this, but I'll still struggle alongside you. It's lower body focused, four exercises. Let's go through them and let's get started. So oftentimes I'll have done the workout before I film it, so it'll be like my second time through. I haven't done this one yet, so this will be an experiment. Our first move is a kettlebell sumo squat. And I'm trying to decide between the 30 pound and 45 pound. Since it's so intense, and this is for when you're short on time and short on intensity for the week, I'm gonna err on the side of the heavier weight. So I'm gonna go with 45 pounds, toes out, heels in, squatting down, chest is proud. You know, fast reps as you can because you're only working for 20 seconds. Obviously, if that gets heavy around round four, five, six, switch to lighter weight, but keep the intensity up. And then move two, I'm gonna use my 30 pound. We're gonna do split stance sw swings. So if my right hand is holding the bell, my right hand is gonna be, or my right leg is gonna be bent back behind me. Swing up, switch sides, left leg, left arm, okay? And actually, I might try it with the 45. Let's see, see how that feels. Or, you know, go back and forth, whatever feels right for you. Again, since it's such a short amount of time, make sure you're pushing hard. Move three is a goblet hold split stance squat or lunge. Um, we're gonna switch sides on this one. So you do left, right, left, right, left, right eight rounds total. So you're gonna have the bell up in this position. And I guess we'll do right leg first, lunge down and just stay here. And we'll do alternating legs each round. From the front, looks like this. You're staying in one spot because you would waste too much time with the transition and the alternating. And then the last move, we're gonna again alternate sides. So right and left, right, left. And it's just a single arm swing. So instead of switching the legs and staggering your stance, we're just gonna keep it in the right arm, swing forward. And round two, you'll switch arms. So left arm will be holding the bell, single arm swings. Okay, so as you can see, you just need one to two weights. I'm probably gonna switch between my 30 and my 45. Man, I'm nervous. Whew, I will have the timer going, so you don't need to worry about anything. Like I said, I might not talk very much at all because it's gonna be tough, but I'll be there with you, and let's get going. All right, we have our 10 second warm up. So get ready, take a sip of water, get your music going. We'll start with the goblet squats in 10 seconds. This one definitely, I would say definitely do your heavier weight. All right, and go, 20 seconds on. It's gonna be very misleading the first few rounds, and then it's gonna burn really good. Good, three more seconds. Okay, rest. Shake out your legs. The rest is minimal. Catch your breath. Oh, this sucks. Go. Even doing this body weight gets super tough. So body weight, go for it. Five more seconds. Last one. Good. Catch your breath and go. At least it's super quick. That's the bonus. Dig through your heels to engage your glutes. Try to stick your chest out a little bit. A couple more. Good. Hoo wee 
30 seconds of rest and go halfway with the first exercise which means we're already an eighth of the way done with the whole thing keep pushing one more rep good halfway done with that one four more rounds breathe Go. Goblet sumo squats. Heart rate's going. Muscles are working. Woo! Good job. Rest. You know, very firm muscles after this. Three, two, one. Doing it all, guys. Hang in there. Oh, a couple more. Last one. Stand. Good. All right. We got, I think, two more rounds. Three, two, one. Go. Keep pushing. I know it burns. I need to it to you. If it's just burn and not pain. Push through it. Holy cow. Good. Hmm. Last round of the squats. Good job. Go. Make it your best yet. Focus. Ooh, feel the burn. Push up through your heels, drive. Good. Look at rest. Four minutes done. We'll rest for about a minute. Let me get that timer going. One minute rest starting now. Oh. And then we have our alternating staggered stance swings. So if the right hand has the bell, you're on the ball of your right foot with your right knee bent. Stand up, switch sides. It's gonna fly by. Take a sip of water, not too much though. I think this style of workout makes me wanna throw up more than any other style. Just a warning, I don't do them often. I haven't done one probably in a year. Whoops, but they're very good for you. Catch your breath. We have 10 seconds left. Alternating stagger stance swings. Start with the heavier bell, see how it feels. Ready, go. Front leg is holding about 70% of the weight, back leg about 30. Stay light on your toes, switching grips, switching foot. Good. Get ready in two seconds. Go. Hinge at your hips, thrust them forward. Don't flex forward at the back too much. Sit back into your glute. Doing good. Couple more. Rest. Five seconds. And begin. Seven seconds. Press that hip forward. Good. Rest. Whew. Three 
seconds rest. Keep going halfway. Halfway after this one. Doing great. Focus on your breathing. Nice job. Four more rounds. I'm breathing too, for sure. And begin. If you're sticking with the heavier weight, good job. If you need to lower down, totally fine. Faster up. Rest. Ready? Go. Get out of your head. Don't even think about the rest. Don't linger any longer. Just pick up the bell and keep going. Good. Two more rounds of this. Nice job. Three, two, one, go. Finish strongest. We're almost halfway done with your entire workout for the day. Breathe. Last round. Three, two, go. Use your breath. Exhale. Doing the hard part. Nice job. All right, minute rest starting now. Woo wee! <sighs> Good job. Touch a sip of water. <sighs> Something you don't have time for in your 10 seconds. Next, we're going to do the split stance squat. So it's just basically a static lunge with a goblet hold. So, right leg first, then left leg. I'm gonna start with the 45, but probably drop down after a couple rounds. We'll see. Oh. You're doing awesome. Halfway done with the whole thing. 10 seconds. So get your bell, clean it up to prepare. Lunging into the right leg. Go. Keep that intensity drive to your heel. If you engage your glute. Core is engaged. Lower ribs are tucked in. Catch up, keep pushing. Nice job. Rest. I want you to clean it up and set yourself before the second starts. So go ahead and get ready now. And lunge into left leg now. Body weight is great. Good. Rest. Oh, Miko, help me. Help us all. Okay, prepare. Right leg in front. Go. Just four on each side. So that helps you feel better. Holy cow. Good, rest. I drop down to my 30 pound. Clean it up, prepare. Left side, go. Whew. Lower 
Ready? Nice job. Rest. Halfway done with this stupid exercise. Just kidding. Right leg in front, prepare. Lunge, go. Back knee softly tucked to the ground. Front leg is doing the majority of the work, but both are balancing. Oh, good, rest. Three, two, one. Left leg. Feel the burn. Keep pushing, guys. Such a short time. Good. We got one more on each side. That's it. We got this. All right, three. Two, one, go. Last one on the right side, I think. 90% sure. I was drunk. Keep driving up. Full lower body workout. One more good rep. Nice. This is the last one of this exercise. Prepare, three, two, one, go. Really whole body's working though. 10 seconds, push it hard. And my timer messed up. Three, two, one, stop. Nice job. All right, one minute rest. Starting now. Good job. That suck. Okay, last move. Single arm swings. I think my back honestly is a limiting factor right now, so I'm probably gonna go lighter weight. But if you don't have an injury, try to really push yourself and go heavier. Maybe I'm gonna try the first round with 45, but be smart too. Not worth injuring yourself. <sighs> Catch your breath. Four more minutes and we're done. So we're gonna start with the right arm, just single arm swings. So keep the hips even. You're not gonna step back with either foot. Whew. And we have 10 seconds. All right, guys, we got this. And your sweaty palms might be the limiting factor. Go. So grab a towel if you need. Pause here, grab a towel. Yep, sweaty hand is definitely my nemesis. All right, rest. Keep going. There we go. You can make intensity out of anything. Three, two, one, rest. Nice job. Three more on each side. Are you crossing your legs? All right, right hand in front. And go. And you get the hips sitting back into your glutes and then driving forward. Slight, obviously bend forward with the trunk, but not super low. Rest. All right, left hand, and go. Slightly in your knees as well. Whew. 
Good rest. Halfway done. <sighs> breathe, breathe, breathe. Five seconds. Wipe your hand and go with your right hand. Left arm can kind of swing back with the bell and then curl up. Whatever you need for your balance and momentum. A little more power than momentum, but whatever. All right, rest. Crushing it. Wipe your left hand. Grab the bell and go. but biceps, your shoulders from holding the front rack. All right, right hand, go. Last one on this side. Miko has resorted to eating his own foot. Keep pushing three, two, one. Rest, last round. Great job. Left hand prepares. Sit back and swing forward. Go. Lower ribs are drawing in. I tend to have a big rib flare. So I'm focusing, I'm gauging everything. 10 seconds. Five. Keep going. Okay, stop. My computer's being weird. Yay! You got an extra two seconds in. Good job. All right, guys. Well, that was fun. Good job during those 19 minutes total. Yeah, I know. Perfect for when you're low on time and low on equipment because all you need is one bell. And I'm pretty cooked. Um, push as hard as you can with good form and as long as you're not hurting yourself, especially that first move, those goblet squats, just go. Like, it's a safe position, just go. I know it's gonna hurt your quads, just go. If you like the workout, please like it. Please share with others so they have something to go to when they're short on time or equipment and just want some intensity. Um, and then subscribe so you, <laughs> stop looking at me. So you see the next video and I'll see you then. You're so silly. You like sweat. Bye.